Musk is now considering bringing back Vine in order to compete with TikTok. For those of you that are unfamiliar, Twitter actually owns Vine and they shut it down back in 2019 due to competition and not many people using the platform anymore. However, on Twitter this morning, Elon Musk asked if he should bring back Twitter and the results were... Well, very good. He even went on to mention what could he do to make Vine better than TikTok, essentially, in which, of course, I had to reply with my comments. Now, I think this is something that is heavily needed because TikTok is a horrendous platform. Everything about it is forced dictatorship from China. For those that don't know, this is a Chinese-ran platform. And every time you post about crypto for the majority of the time, they flag it as an illegal good because it is illegal over in China. So they try to force all of their viewpoints on us in America, which is not something you really want to do considering all of our freedoms that we have here. They try to force all this stuff onto us, and it's absolutely just a horrible freaking place. So Vine would be an amazing platform. I would use it more than TikTok. As a matter of fact, I think it would cause TikTok to rethink all of their strategic plays. I think that they'll start changing how they view things such as crypto being an illegal good, such as the stock market being something they don't want on their platform. In case you're unfamiliar with this, they don't want any way for people to make money on their actual platform. So if I were to give out free advice on what to invest in, they will delete it. They have done so six or seven times on this platform. That's why I don't do like a one month type of free information post because they just delete it and they flag it. Once I hit so many flags, they delete my account. Now, I also heavily consider that Dogecoin could play a major factor again in Vine as well. And if Elon Musk keeps on this path, he is not only going to take Dogecoin to a dollar, we may very well see Dogecoin actually surpass even $10 sometime over the next five to six years. Now, this is going to be absolutely massive. And I think Elon Musk is doing such an amazing freaking job. He even went as far to post on Twitter under his account saying that he wants to bring freedom of speech to both the left and the right on an unbiased level. So for everybody who thinks he's some awful dictator, he actually wants true freedom of speech. And if you have a problem with freedom of speech for both sides of the political party, then you are actually the problem. Now, for everybody that's on TikTok, I'm actually over on Twitter heavily. I actually stopped using it a while ago, but I've been using it recently because Elon Musk acquired it and has made it great again. It's less toxic. It's a lot better. You can follow me over at Daily Investor X. Now, of course, if Vine opens up, what I'm going to do is I'm going to create an account over there, but also between Twitter and Vine, I'm going to give away free day trades once a month, every single month on my accounts over on Twitter and Vine. So be sure to follow over on Twitter and Vine. And if you want daily trade information every single day that the market is open, be sure to join the Discord at patreon.com slash sleepbiker because last month we made over 1,000% on the ROI just in day trades. This month, just in day trades alone, we're up over 800%. So if you want to make a killing during this recession so you're not sitting there losing money, worrying about how to make ends meet, you can make money consistently over in the Discord if you learn pay attention, and do exactly what you were taught. Because everybody who actually learns what they're taught over there is making money consistently every single day in that Discord. So once again, yes, I am looking heavily forward to Elon Musk reopening Vine, which again would be very easy for him to do considering it is owned by Twitter.